This is IAL Biology and today we're talking about protein folding from unit 1. Protein folding is the method where a two-dimensional primary structure of a protein turns into three dimensions. There are four levels of protein structure. Primary, secondary, and tertiary are enough to make a functional protein. For many proteins, a quaternary structure is also required. Primary structure of a protein is a sequence of amino acids joined by peptide bonds. Hydrogen bonds are responsible for folding the primary structure into a structure known as alpha helix, in addition to another secondary structure known as beta pleated sheets. What I have here is a protein folded in its tertiary structure. You can see how the intermolecular forces are responsible for this folding. One important fact about tertiary structure is the position of the R groups. You can see that the polar or the charged R groups are on the surface of the protein, while the hydrophobic R groups are inside. This ensures that the exterior of the protein is interacting with the water molecules around while the interior is hidden from the water and that enables the protein to form that 3D shape. In many cases, more than one polypeptide chains are joined by means of disulfide bridges and hydrogen bonds and this forms what we call a quaternary structure. 